The battle lines have been drawn. It's time to unbox another Civil War character. <laughs> Team Iron Man. Hey guys, me host Super Sorrel. Thank you very much for tuning in. It's time to unbox another Titan hero. Team Iron Man. I am well Team Iron Man in this debate. I was a Team Cap guy. Recently I've changed. I'm now a Team Iron Man guy. <laughs> I'm a defector. Really like Iron Man. I like this figure as well. Um, the fact that when you play all the sounds across with the um, Captain America doll and um, with the others, it does sound like the talking, which is dead weird. But I'm going to open this up for you. Now this is um, part of the new Civil War series, exclusive to the Disney Store. I have seen it in Toys R Us though the other day, um, as well. So I was a little bit upset because I was told this was going to be a Disney Store exclusive item, but it does turn out that it was a timed exclusive. So other retailers are getting them. Now the Titan Hero series isn't a new thing. This has been around for um, a while now with Marvel. They've made quite a few different sets based on their movies and TV. But I like this particular set because it comes with, you know, the, the little voice box. Um, so they have phrases that they say. <clears throat> I know, I think Spider-Man had that in the Disney Store as well. I wish they'd make a Civil War Spider-Man, but they're not giving anything away, are they, about that? So, the figure, first of all, let's have a look at him. It's very nice. It's based on the current Iron Man suit from the movies. Um, his hand comes up. Um, it isn't poseable, but it does have the thing on the inside. I wish that had an LED in it. If that had an LED inside to light up like in the films, that would be amazing, but it doesn't. So he's got a hand that goes out and then he's got his fist to batter Captain America's face in. Now, there are no elbow joints on these particular characters. The arms just go up and down and are static. Same with the legs. They can go up and down, but they are static. No knee or foot joint. Now, these do take AA batteries. You can just slot them in the back by unscrewing the back panel. But let's get to the good stuff. Now, this one does have an LED in the front chest. Um, well, in the stomach area of this chest. Is that a chest? You can't really tell with the size of this chest plate that he wears. But it's in the top part of the chest. Uh, let's push it and find out. I'm taking fire. Shield up. <laughs> now, the only thing with these characters so far is they're not. it's not Robert Downey Jr. and Chris Evans' voices that are attached to these figure sets. Uh, which is quite sad. I wish, you know, like, like they did with the Star Wars um, Titan series for The Force Awakens, I would have liked to have heard, to heard more of the movie um, sounds coming out of it. So, I mean, they, they didn't have to give away any plot points. They just had to give us some of the lines from the film that we've already heard, like in the trailer. If you could put both of them together and have them say, I thought I was your friend, that would have been the best thing ever. That line is now synonymous with this movie. And there's been so many memes based on these two. You know, the... It would have been amazing to have a toy set that, you know, when you put them together, actually said those things. That would just be so cool. Hasbro, saw it out. Iron Man Mark 46. Iron Man Mark 46. Powering up. <laughs> yeah, don't make me do this. Okay, now let's go get Cap and let's put the two together for the first time. have been drawn. It's Civil War time. Whose side are you on? Let me know in the comments down below with the hashtag Team Cap. <laughs> hashtag Team Iron Man. <laughs> and I'm your host Super Sorrel. Thank you very much for tuning in guys and I'll speak with you again soon. I can barely see you over these guys. Bye!